I came home this evening with intentions to do a chick update, but unfortunately I didn't really want to do them under these circumstances. Don't worry, they're all okay. Unfortunately, my heat lamp isn't. I came home and this thing was off. You can hear it's, it's obviously blown. And these guys were in the dark. So what I ended up doing was, this is the old lamp casing that I was using. And I used to be into screen printing shirts as just like a hobby. And I put a 150 watt light inside there in order to create some heat on here and keep these guys warm. Uh, I didn't really want to do it this way, but unfortunately it's like six o'clock right now and there are no places open to get a heat lamp and I don't have a backup. The good news is this thing's putting off a good amount of heat. It's 150 watts and I believe this one was uh, 250, so it's not gonna be quite as warm, but I do have this other one here. This is a 75 watt bulb and I kind of wanted to get your opinion. I'm hoping some people watch us tonight to see if maybe I should put this in as well, just to keep them a little warmer. I mean, the good news is, as you can see, they're okay. They're just kind of freaked out, I think, because of the situation here. But they're starting to get their feathers. So this would be the chick update part of this. You can see their wings and stuff. They're just trying to get out of here. But uh, I guess it is kind of disturbing when your whole world changes with this, you know, this new light and me just kind of hovering over them here. But uh, as I was mentioning, they're, they're all getting their wings, which you can see. So they are probably going to be able to stay a little warmer, especially if they huddle up on each other. But I can't afford to lose anymore, and I don't want to lose anymore. So I need to know, is this 150-watt bulb that's in there going to work? Or should I add this extra one in, too? I'm thinking about adding it just for precaution's sake, just uh, because tomorrow I'll end up getting more of these. I actually might get two, because it doesn't hurt to have a backup, and I could kick myself for not having a backup right now. Just for reference, here's how the light setup would be with the two. I'm thinking about leaving it in there for the time being, but uh, the, the one in the back there, that's the 150 watt, and that is just a super bright bulb. That's used for, back when I was screen printing, that was used for heating the shirts to adhere the ink, and it worked really well for that and created a lot of heat, so I thought it'd be perfect for this. And the 75 watt, that's not really quite the same bulb, but it could be used for this and obviously generate a little bit of extra heat for them if they need it. And uh, again, here they are in the corner. They're just, I think, really freaked out with the stuff that's going on now, and I'm sure the bright light's probably a little disturbing considering it's been the red light the whole time. They seem to be acting normally. As you can see, they're kind of liking that light spot there and kind of just jumping all over each other, but they seem to be acting normally, and they were, they were fine when I got home and it was completely dark in there, so I'm hoping that everything's fine, but I just want to check to be sure. So I just wanted to show you how they are acting now, if that's any indicator, um, and hopefully everything's okay with these guys. So again, this is really important. I know there's people that watch my channel that have a lot of knowledge about chickens and raising chicks, and maybe you can help me with this. Let me know if this setup that I have is going to work for tonight. If you think this is going to be a problem, even with the two lights, let me know because I can maybe modify it. Or if you have any other suggestions, I'm really anxious to hear it. I'll be looking at the comments uh, as the night goes on. So uh, I'm hoping that a lot of people watch this that maybe have some ideas for me. And uh, again, I appreciate your help with this. I know the internet's a powerful place and you've proved it in the past and I hope you prove it tonight. So thanks for watching and uh, we'll, we'll see what happens here.